Hi guys and welcome back to a new video. In today's video, I just want to remind you that you can right now get some free knowledge and skill points for all your different professions with the War Within. You can also get plus 10% of reputation points with all the different factions in the War Within. And finally, you can also get an additional 10% for your experience gain. And so this is something that you can do right now and I would really, really recommend you to do it because it will help you to get all these things way, way faster. So in order to get all these different things, it's going to be very simple. You just want to make your way to the Darkwind Fair Island. And in order to access the Darkwind Fair Island, you have to go to any of the capital cities, especially Stormwind or Orgrimmar. And here you will be able to find some emissaries of the Darkwind Fair Island. And you just want to talk to them. They will transport you in front of the main portal to access the Darkwind Fair. And then you just want to click on the portal and you will like that be able to make your way to the Darkwind Fair Island. And here I just want to insist on the fact that the Darkwind Fair Island is available starting today until next Saturday at midnight. So really make sure to do all these different things during this time frame because after that, sadly, you won't be able to benefit from all these really good advantages. So once you're there, the first thing you want to do if you have any of the different professions for the War Within is to go and look at your minimap and normally you will see some quest marks. And so all you have to do is to go and pick up the different quests that are linked to your specific professions. As you can see, you will simply need to complete a few things around the Darkwind Fair Island. From time to time, you will also need to go outside of the Darkwind Fair Island and get a few things around the different starting areas. But most of the time, this is something you can do in just a few minutes. You just want to go around, do the little activities that the profession quest is requiring you to do. And then you want to complete the quest. And here, as you can see, you will be able to get both some knowledge points and also some skill points, which is super, super useful if you have been struggling a little bit to find some new ways right now to get more knowledge points and skill points. And this is something you can do for all the different professions. And especially you can do it on all your different characters. So really something that I would recommend you to not miss out on because if you do miss out on these different points during this week, sadly, you won't be able to get them back. And then you will have to wait for the next month to get some additional ones. But again, each time you can get some extra points. And so these are really things you want to get if you are trying to be a little bit competitive with the different professions in the War Within. And in general, as a reminder, this is something you can do on a monthly basis. So really every month, make sure to make your way to the Darkwind Fire Island and do all these profession quests because you will be able like that each time to get some additional knowledge and skill points super easily. Then next to that, you also have this buff right here, We oui. So as you can see with this buff, you will be able to get an experience and reputation gain increased by 10%, which is really, really useful. Especially right now, the different factions and the different renowns are very important because you will be able to unlock tons of different type of rewards, of currencies and other interesting things. And so with this extra 10%, you will be able to do that way faster, which is super, super useful. And of course, if you're still not level 80 or if you're already leveling up some alts, having an experience gain of 10% is really good as well. So this is really something I would recommend you to pick up. So here, all you have to do is to go in the Darkwind Fair Island again, and you want to either go and do the little carousel. So all you have to do is to talk to the main vendor that is in front of the carousel, buy some tickets, and then you just want to sit there. And every second, you will be able to get an extra 5% or five minutes. And so then you can get this buff for up to 60 minutes. And so like that, you will be able to have the buff for 60 minutes. Or you can also go and do the roller coaster. So this is really up to you. Both of them will grant you this Wii buff. And so this is personal preferences here. If you prefer the roller coaster, just go on it. Then, of course, what you can also do is come right here and talk to that vendor. And here, as you can see, you will be able to buy this Dark Moon top hat. These are items that will cost you 10 of the different Dark Moon price tickets. And basically, you can use them at any time and you will reapply the buff for another hour. So this is something that is very useful 
if you are not planning to come back all the time to the Dark Moon Fair Island, and if you just want to always have the buff applied on your character, you can just buy a bunch of these, and like that, you will be able to apply them at any time. Because of course, it's important also for you to remember that if you die with the buff, sadly, the buff will go away. And so if you have some of these top hats, it will be very useful for you to then reapply the buff super easily. Then another interesting thing you can do is ask for your fortune to this guy. And basically, you will be able to get a two hours buff that will increase some of your different stats. So for instance, sometimes you can get plus 10% of stamina. Here, me personally, I chose the 6% of all damage. And so again, this is something that can be very useful if you're currently leveling up. This is always nice to have this type of extra buff. And here, as you can see, these are all the different potential buffs you can get and what routes you need to follow in order to end up with the right buff. And so this is, again, just an extra little thing you can do to make your character even more performant. And hopefully, it will also help you level up a little bit faster or do any of the other activities you're currently doing a little bit faster in the war with it. And for this one, also, sadly, if you die, you will lose it. So again, try not to die because otherwise you will lose it. And I don't think you can get this buff again during the same Dark Moon Fair. So just something again for you to remember. So that's pretty much it for today's video. I just wanted to provide you with this reminder. Hopefully you will be able to enjoy all these different advantages while the Dark Moon Fair is up. Again, you have until next Saturday at midnight to enjoy all of that. I will be back very soon with more guides and more videos. And in the meantime, I wish you all a great day. Bye.